all right y'all so the nissan is done ready to sell i got my person coming out right now i'm going to start this thing up real quick and let's let's get it y'all let's go man welcome back to chuck's daily hustle make sure that you right now man hit the thumbs up button smash that notification bell hit that subscribe button so you can join the La Familia, man. And then go in the description below. I have a whole bunch of links for you guys. Go ahead and check me out on all the social media platforms, man. So right now, you guys, I am picking up um, the Nissan Versa. I'm in the Nissan Versa right now, actually. Just got dropped off. And you guys can see this interior. It is super clean, you guys. Super clean. Um, I'm getting ready to go get that exhaust work done. I got the wheel covers in the back, y'all. If you guys remember this, this uh, car, then you know how it looked. I'm gonna show you, get you a little once around. I gotta move around because I got an hour before that muffler shop uh, close. So let me show you guys what this thing looks like. I'm cool with the job that was done. This thing was horrible. I don't like that little dirt right there, but sometimes you can't get all them stains out. Still got that dent, but it doesn't look that bad. And uh, yeah, man, let me just show you guys. And like I said, I got the wheel covers in the back, the aftermarket joints. Hopefully we can get this thing gone, sold, out of there. So uh, let me get to it, take these pictures, and then get this thing posted and all that good stuff, man. So let's get on the road. Change of plans, you guys. So uh, the guy just hit me for the Infinity M35. So I'm actually heading out towards the office, which is fine because if you guys been watching the vlogs, then you know I found me a different exhaust guy out there. So he's a little bit more expensive. And uh, yeah, man, so it actually is paying off for me to have a lot more connections, man. Me being forced to make different business connections is starting to work out. So, um, you know, it's only up from here. So anyways, uh, let's get this thing sold. I will see you guys either at the exhaust shop or I will see you guys over at the office. So let's get it. All right, y'all. So I am at the lot and I did not get to the exhaust shop first because the guy hit me. So. Um, as you can see, the verse is there. Here is the Infinity M35X. Too bad I gotta sell it. Too bad I need some money. Look, hey, guess what I did yesterday, guys? I did the dummy, and I went and to the casino, man. Went to the casino, and I lost some money yesterday. So I'm mad, very, very mad. I didn't lose that much money though, y'all. Just, just a couple hundred dollars, but still, it's nothing to do in Minnesota. But back to these cars. She's a beauty, man. 185,000 miles. This is actually a refer a referred customer, so I'm pretty sure. So he seemed like a younger dude. Seemed like he's super super happy, super super ecstatic about it. And I'm gonna be super super happy when I sell this joint. So I'm just gonna put a couple of dollars in gas in here, and then uh, we shall be straight, man. So um, and I got a story for you guys later. To, well, to finish up on a story, and that has to do with my repeat customer, the gangster. I, I'm gonna tell you about that. My customer is here, man. So he's gonna dry that joint, you can see out there. So hopefully you can get this money face after this and we'll be straight, man. Um, it's crazy, man, I'm gonna show you guys something too. Might be my weird customer that I'm gonna tell you guys about later. But look at this. So my key, y'all, my keyhole, it looks like somebody was messing with it. If you look at the grooves. Um, so my key started acting funny today. And my brother said his key was acting a little funny today too. So I don't know if somebody tried to get in here last night or whatever but it is what it is man um anyways let's just get to it man money face man infinity is out of there man it's gone finito all you see is that little versa man so super happy man super static always grateful man um yeah so i'm happy with it man um now i need to basically we got uh tremaine's coming up here He's got to show his cobalt. Um, so, yeah, that's dope, huh? So, I guess he took pictures or maybe he's got a referral. I don't know. So, I'm going to get that thing. Well, he's about to sell that thing. Um, I'm going to try to get a ride back to my car before or after. I don't know, man. We got a lot of stuff we're trying to do. And then I got somebody coming out for that Volvo S80, man. So, that S80 might be going today. Dude's coming all the way from Wisconsin. So, hopefully, I can get that thing sold. And then, you know, we got two cars gone. And then we can just move on. Um, with the other batch of cars that we got out here. So um, basically getting rid of all my premium cars are kind of just gone, huh? So those are leaving 
pretty much Infinity will be gone, the Volvo will be gone. And then we got the Hyundai Tucson left. That needs still needs to be fixed. I haven't been able to go out till you pull it. I'm gonna have to. I probably should have never told uh, <laughs> or maybe I should. I don't know. You, if you guys remember, you've been, if you've been here for a while, you know Black Chris. Remember Black Chris? And I stopped doing business with him, and I told him I wasn't gonna do business with him unless he reached out to me. But I probably should have kept him kind of under the under the uh, hat. You know what I mean? Just a little bit. Because he was perfect for like going to the junkyard and getting those odd and odds and end parts. But um yeah, man. But it is what it is. I'm gonna have to find somebody else. Uh oh, there goes Tremaine right there. He just pulling he's pulling up. So um anyways, that is that. I'm gonna have to I'm not gonna have enough time to tell you the story, you guys. Just stay tuned to the end of the video. I'll give you guys and don't skip, because we got a lot of stuff we about to do. So uh <laughs> I'm gonna tell y'all all about the drama at the end of the video. Um, I can tell you that it's finally over and done with, finished. Um, so yeah, so I will see you guys in a second. Let's All right, y'all. So here's that rusty Durango for the new guys. <laughs> Super Durango. Oh, I'm just, I'm vlogging, bro. So I'm about to hit it with some paint. But uh, we're gonna make it look a little better for whoever gets it. And then uh, we're gonna post it. Hey, you know, y'all know what's crazy too? Is when you buy cars, man, you start to see like people leave notes for themselves. For the new buyers all types of stuff man um but yeah this thing is pretty rusty man it's real clean i know y'all saw it in the dark before but now you can see it again that back is horrible i gotta figure that out i'm gonna get try to get all that off and we'll be straight here's tremaine's car now it looks a lot better he hit it with that paint too i think he better at painting than me um he didn't get a chance to clean it out but he's hitting bites on it but yeah so he's got some uh body coming out right now hey bro you probably want to hit that door jam in the back i think you missed that one in the far left yeah okay guys obviously i am at the office and i am waiting on my customer to pull up for the volvo s80 so they just drove four hours y'all from wisconsin somewhere in wisconsin to come get this car so that's the v8 all-wheel drive if y'all don't know how rare that car is and obviously they knew what they wanted so um i'm gonna uh, basically i'm um, getting ready to run up to holiday just because um i did see a little play in the steering wheel when i was just driving straight so i just want to check um the tire pressure i'm gonna go check the tire pressure right now if it's not even i'm gonna go make it even over at the holiday put the air in there and then that should fix the problem it's just like a little little bit of play but i just want you know to make sure that it's cool they ain't got nothing to say when they get here i know they're gonna buy it but you know i just like to make sure we straight so um anyway i'll let you guys know what happens tremaine just left his appointment is actually coming for the cobalt at the same time as me his prior appointment flaked on him they didn't even come so we just trying to move and move like we always are man okay guys so the customer is here he brought his family his twin brother his sister and her boyfriend so they're all here and they seem to be very very ecstatic and happy about seeing the car so pretty sure this thing is going um also man i just met a cool dude by the name of bob down at the holiday gas station he just saw the car he was like oh nice car started talking to me i started talking to him and uh basically we spoke for about five minutes and uh he i basically said that he does like uh, endorsement deals or something like that and he said i was a good uh could be a good brand ambassador so um he just liked how our conversation went we were just talking and um as i told you i mean your boy can actually speak when i'm not talking to this camera i don't say a lot when i'm talking to you directly okay but in this camera i do so anyways man um we talked and he sent me his number um his name and all that stuff so hopefully we'll get something going i gotta see obviously um what exactly um he's talking about so anyways let's get this money face going in a second and then that'll be number two. Oh, posted the nissan versa i actually ended up i didn't bring it to the muffler shop i brought it to my mechanic and i was like hey do you can you look at this real quick he's like oh i can weld it so he's fixing the uh the, the thing for me right now the versa i already took uh pictures of it i posted it i got like five people that want to actually see that car and um i'm just waiting on him to let me know that it's done so once that's done then boom i'm gonna try to sell that one and then me and Tremaine will finally get out there. He's uh, getting ready to show his cobalt right now, too. So um, we just moving the groove and let's get it. Money face, man. Volvo S80 is gone. Here is the customers. They are out there. They probably going to actually end up watching this video because 
they've been watching my videos. So that's super, super dope. Um, and they were appreciative of it. I'm appreciative of you guys as well. Um, Gage, shout out to you, brother. Um, and if you are watching this video, comment below. Let them know that you got the S80. Um, and yeah, man, I just really appreciate you guys for all the support and everything. Um, Tremaine, he's still out there, I guess, um, doing his thing. So we're going to see what how this day transpires and what ends up coming up. So um, hopefully he sells that. And then I don't know, I'm trying to get, give you all a money face or something. Um, but yeah, they're gone, man. They're out of there. So I just missed them. But yeah, they're gone, man. He said he's, he just can't wait. So came out four hours, man. That's super dope. Um, anyways, um, I don't even know what I'm thinking about right now. It's got a lot of stuff going on. So I will see you guys in a second once we get settled back or I get settled back down. Cause as you can see, I'm just energized, man. So see you on a second. All right, y'all. So the Nissan is done, ready to sell. I got my person coming out right now. I'm going to start this thing up real quick and let you guys hear what it sounds like. First time having the mechanic welded. So let's hear I got a money face before it even happened, man. Oh, this is gone, bro. Yeah, man. This is man, that's what I'm talking about, man. Get you somebody reliable that's gonna help you out, man. This is how um Chris used to be. I, I, well, I talked about black Chris, I gotta say white Chris used to be, man. White Chris used to really, really um Dude, like he would be knocking out stuff like crazy, but I ain't gonna lie to you, man. This guy right here is super dope, like super nice. I just thank you. Yeah, he just shut the gate for me and everything, man. See, man. So, anyways, man. Um, also, you know he, you know he charges a little bit more, but for the convenience of me having to just get that done right then and there, that's cool, man. Like that, that just means a lot, man. I told him that too. Like you know, you really, really helped me out really really um save the day so um let's get this thing sold and then we can move on to the next um cars next week man so man it's just been a good good feeling man the business has been flowing um the dude didn't end up buying uh tremaine's cobalt but he's got like 15 people that's trying to come out there and see um also my uh i got like 10 people that's already messaged me about the car so i'm pretty sure this thing is going to be gone i i most definitely made the right play and I didn't even do it on purpose, y'all. Like, I was getting ready to bring it to a muffler shop in St. Paul. Then y'all know I ended up coming out here. I was getting ready to just say, forget it, drop it off to the Anoka shop. And then me just being being a person that asks questions, um, I just asked, can you do it? Yeah, I can do it. And, you know, he made it happen. So that's super dope, man. So don't be afraid to ask questions. Don't be afraid to talk to people. Like, step out of sit outside of your comfort zone y'all but anyways man i will see you guys in a second and hopefully we can finish this with a third money face in the same day baby all right y'all so my customers are here they're out there right now this is super funny y'all so um these are the guys that just came out for the uh toyota camry a couple of days ago whatever i mean the, the corolla and they didn't end up buying the car so I got out and he, his name was Jackie. So the dude's name is Jackie. So I remember thinking it was a girl last time, and because I, I never I didn't look at the uh, profile. So um, I seen Jackie today. I thought it was a woman again. Like I, I think I said that earlier. So uh, he ends up coming. And so I'm like Jackie. Oh, I look at him and he got his mask. I said, "Ain't you the dude that just leave the Corolla?" And he said, "Yeah." And uh, his friend starts laughing or whatever because he came with him and brought him. You know what I mean? So um, dude. Uh, I think that's another customer for the Cobalt. I think so. I think Tremaine's person is here now for the Cobalt too, so I might have to show that car. But um, anyways, man, uh, he, this guy started laughing. I said, I guess I must have the best cars on there. I said, I sold the Corolla. And he said, oh, yeah. So it's like, yeah, dude. Like, I got some solid products. So anyways, let's see what happens. Okay, guys. So I just got the, I just ran out there, helped him get the hood open on it. They just came back from the test drive. And he was like the blower motor's a little bit noisy but i let them know man hey this is an older car um you know this is an older car so you know they're gonna have little you know quirks you know i'm not gonna make them perfect but they you know it's a good car i mean he just passed up the corolla because they had a sensor on for an o2 um o2 sensor so hopefully he makes the right decision um otherwise then we got other people to come buy this car so um that'll be on him all uh, right guys so um it was about two hours later my bad the people didn't buy the car um 
that dude seems to be like very very meticulous and it's like stop following me on marketplace like you get on my nerves you're wasting my time um the people didn't buy tremaine's car but we got our second set of appointments out here that confirmed so hopefully these cars will be sold and then we can be cool but these are my our last appointments we're not taking any more i'm tired i want to go home it's been a long day so I will let you guys know what happens as soon as we find out. Money face, man. So I got the... What car let's sell, bro? Oh, well, he looking at me like, what's that, bro? What's that? It's <laughs> the like money face. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't no. never... You must not be watching the videos, huh? Uh -uh. Yeah, so you got, this, you got to do the money face, man. So you just smile at the camera. Then you money face him. You know what oh. I'm saying? <laughs> when that customer heard you. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so the other day, man, uh, when I was doing the video, the customer, when I was out there selling that, uh, what was that, bro? The Mercury... Mountain, Mountaineer. Yeah, the Mercury Mountaineer. Uh, he said the customer was in here just uh, like, dang, he's happy. He's selling the car. But um, yeah, we both just sold our cars, man. So we both got the blue faces secured in the bag, man. So um, I'm a little bit tired, man. So I'm going to give you all the story time on a whole separate video. But what I will do is I'll drop it on the same day that you see this video. So... Um, I'll give you the story, like I said, a little bit later in the day, probably be around like five o'clock. I'll schedule like five, between five and 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. I got y'all. But um, until tomorrow, I'll see you then. I'm out. Peace.